We'll guide you through how to download and install Fatbreak in Minecraft 1.21.6. If you find this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. Fatbreak is going to allow you to go and add mods to the game, so we'll guide you through how this can be done. To get started, let's come out of Minecraft. Now what we need to do is open up a web browser of your choice. I'll use Chrome, but it doesn't matter. And what you want to do is go and type in Minecraft Fabric, like so. And you can come to the Fabric site, which is fabricmc.net. Here we are. Then what you can do is go and press download. What we can do is go and download it for Windows. If you're using Mac, you can get the jar, but the download for Windows will be easier to use. We've now downloaded that. Now we also need to get the Fabric API. This will go and allow us to go and add mods. So we can go and click there, like so. Now what we can do is go and read about this, but it's pretty simple. We need to come to the files and then you can then scroll down. We need to make sure we get it for the same version as we got Fabric 4, which is 1.21.6. So it says filter by, we can select game versions and select 1.21.6 and here it is. We can come to the right, press the three dots and press download file and wait. Now that's gone and downloaded. What we can now do is go and get some mods here as well. So I'll just go and select mods. Then what we can do is scroll down and filter for the game version 1.21.6 so they'll be compatible. Let's go and say I wanted the Waystones mod. I can go and click on it. I'll press files at the top and we can then make sure we get it for 1.21.6 and for fabric. I'll press the three dots to the right and press download file. We've now downloaded what we need, but before we get any further, a big shout out to Apex Hosting for sponsoring this video. If you're in need of a Minecraft server, make sure you go to the link in the description or the pinned comment. And in the moment, you can get 25% off your first invoice. So definitely come and check them out. They've got so many great features like one click and store mod packs, DDoS protection, 24 seven servers and support, ultra latency, instant setup, and so many other great features. So definitely go and check them out. Now let's start the install process. Open up your file explorer and press downloads to the left. You need to go and find the fabric installer and double click on it like so. Here you need to make sure the 1.21.6 is selected and you can press install and wait. It's now finished. We can press OK. Now you can close out of this and you need to go and open up the Minecraft launcher. Go to the top and you can press installations. Now scroll down and we need to go and find fabric 1.21.6 and press the folder to the right. In here, you can go and scroll down and go and find the mods folder. If it isn't here, you can go and create one, come into it. And then what we need to do is come back to our downloads and you need to go and add in the API. And as well as the API, you need to go and add in the mod or mods. I've now added them like so, and we can close them. Now you can come to the right of the fabric loader for 1.21.6 and press play, understand the risks and get started. In this case, I had an error. It looks like I need to go and get Baum Fabric. I downloaded and installed it and I relaunched Minecraft and here we are. Now let's go and get into a world and I'll go and show you it. If I open up my inventory and come to the search, I can type in Waystone and here they are. That's it. If you found this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. Remember, if you need a Minecraft server, you can go and check out Apex. A big thanks to them for sponsoring this video. I look forward to help you again in the future. Goodbye for now.